Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Yoruba actress Uluwa Tuni Ibrahim Ajayi, me twins that stepdaughter to me talk with. I also went ahead to share this adorable moment on our social media platform. Yes, it was just yesterday that Uluwa Tuni Ibrahim changed her name officially from Tony Ibrahim to Mrs. Uluwa Tuni Ibrahim Ajayi. Don't forget that her first name change happened three years ago when she changed her name from Tony Aimaku to Tony Abraham and she said that since then it has been a journey and story of faithfulness of God. And coincidentally, it was also around this time that she changed her name that she actually started something serious with her husband. Then they were just dating. Oh, deadly. And before then, they had known each other for 10 good years. Toya has also confessed over time that she is indeed blessed with a lovely family. Her husband, her stepdaughter and their son. Irulua and Jeremy. These two are always giving us mother-daughter duo goals every time. And they never stop to appreciate and love each other and also show off this on their social media platforms. Then she had the photo and said, Twinny with my daughter. And we talk with Jeremy. And I have never seen a smiley face that is not beautiful. And Timmy talk with Added love you, mommy. It was just a month ago that Tony Abraham revealed that her daughter is now a commercial model, and she was so excited about this. And she also shared a professional video of the Middle West photo shoots in order to launch her modeling career. And yes, all who Tony Abraham and Jamie, the Middle is not her stepdaughter, but her own daughter. Because for Tony, she has fully adopted her husband's teenage daughter as her own daughter. Temitokwe is Kola Wale Ajiemi's teenage daughter. And for Toye Abraham Ajiemi, she decided to be a positive force in the society years ago when she changed her name. She also takes her time to give back to the society and also try and motivate and share wise words with her fans on social media platforms. It was less than a month ago that this movie started a lengthy note and explained how she came to realize that life was not easy and how a person could start to feel hopeless once they are have not achieved a lot at a certain age and she went ahead to say that god did not create people to live another person's life but to live just to the fullest adding that it was easy to compare oneself to others but that people should not let the glitzy life on social media frustrate them and she encouraged people who were struggling with self-doubt not to give up because god still had plans for them this was exactly what she shared. And it is why I have come to realize that God didn't create all of us to live one another's lives, but to live to the fullest, the life he wants for every one of us individually. I know we live in a world where it is so easy to daily compare our lives to other people's, but the truth is, there is no wisdom in letting social media glitz and glamour frustrate you into giving yourself the permission to put yourself down and convince you that you're not doing well enough. Believe me, I know that life is not easy. I know that you feel like you're growing older and you haven't even achieved one quarter of the things you planned for your life. I know you're done with school and there is no job yet for some people. I know that sometimes you do feel like everybody's moving forward and you're being left behind. I know that you're tired of being your supporter, friend, encourager. I know you feel exhausted. We don't give up. Everything is going to be alright. Life is not a smooth sailing boat. And you've got to trust that even your present labor, God still has plans for you. You're not a mistake. Life doesn't hate you and neither are you better off dead. Only the living can be hopeful. Don't let the troubles of now tell you that tomorrow will never be any different. Focus more on yourself than you're invested in other people's being and living. Nobody deserves your attention more than you. All the attention you give to wishing for other people's lives points into yourself. Ask yourself, am I then utilizing my potentials? Am I self-sabotaging? How can I improve my skills and develop myself for better opportunities? Trust God with all of your heart. Be grateful for all that you have, have and can afford. One thing comparison never fails to do is that it blocks your sense of gratitude. It tells you that there is nothing to be grateful for. But it is a lie. Gratitude opens new doors. Stop wallowing in self-pity. Stop hating on you now. So Abraham is married to Kola Olea Jeremy as mentioned earlier and that is why she's now Uluwa Toyin Abraham Ajayemi and she officially changed the name as mentioned earlier. Kola Wale Ajayemi is a prominent Yoruba actor who started acting in the 90s under the tutelage of the Venezuelan Yoruba actors Isiaka Udutola Omiogbo and Shegun Akonye Ogunbe. And since then, he has gone ahead to fully establish himself as an actor, a producer and a director. He has featured in over hundreds of movies. His movies include Buga, Chotu Alapata Ijodwa Iwosi, Bigiga Sondi Daburu Jo Kinjo Ekun Sumi Sumi Bayo Ifen, Okala Pastor Iruko Irukun La Kokoro Unwaye Asson Otamokon Lajayi Manji Alabe Uru, Bemisiri Ujuna Wolo Ekumero Uruluwo, 
Onome Agaga and Oma Yeniwa among others. His recent movies are Osha and Emialaisha, which is currently trending on this platform, YouTube. Also, Tony is known for her comic roles and for her blockbuster movies. Some of the movies she has featured in and some that she has produced include Fate of Lakada 2020, DRF 2020, Small Chops 2020, Elevator Baby 2019, Don't Get Mad, Get Even 2019, Made in Heaven 2019, The Millions 2019, Casanova 2019, Bling Legoshans 2019, Nimbi 2019, Ghost and Tower 2018, Seven and a Half Dates 2018, This Guys 2018, What Just Happened 2018, Alakada Reloaded 2017, Sui 2017, Hakunde 2017, Mentally 2017, Tattoo 2017, Lord of Fever 2017, Paris and Strider Revolution 2017, Celebrity Marriage 2017, Oka Law 2016, What Makes You Think 2016, Lanima Balawake 2013, Ebi Minus 2013, Alakada 2013, and Shola Fek Mami among others. So he has also won two major awards this year, Best Actress of the Year. Africa Choice Awards and Best Actress in Africa, Africa Magic Real Choice Awards, CNVC 2020. Some of our previous awards include Best Supporting Actress, Africa Magic Real Choice Awards, CNVC 2018 for the movie title, Best Actress, Exquisite Lady of the Year, Eloy 2017 for the movie Alakada Reloaded, the Best May Act and Giant Entertainment Awards, NEA 2017, Best Actress in Hollywood, Mockley All Youth Awards, Maya 2017, the Best Supporting Actress feature film. Five Continents International Film Festival 2017 for the movie Hakunde, Best Indigenous Actress, Nigerian Entertainment Awards 2014, and Best Actress, Ben TV Awards 2014 for the movie Alakada. And some of the nominations include Best Actress in the Supporting Role, English, Best on Hollywood 2019 for the movie Diamond in the Sky, Best Actress in the Supporting Role, African Movie Academy Awards, AMA 2018 for the movie Esui, Best Supporting Actress, Yoruba, Best on Hollywood Awards, 2013 for the movie A B Mini. She's also one of the biggest social influencers we have in Nigeria and one of the richest and most influential actresses we have. In total, she has about 5.9 million followers on her Instagram, and that is only on Instagram, not including other social media platforms. In addition to this, Doing is also a successful entrepreneur, and her husband Kolawale is also an entrepreneur. Kolawale is the CEO of Kolawale Odens and Shoes, and he's also the CEO of Ajo Majo School of Performing Arts, which is located in Abdokuta. Toyin Hebram is the CEO of Cuts Limited by Toyin Body Talk by Toyin Tokitila by Toyin and Plush Hair by Toyin. What is their daughter, Timmy Talk by is a professional commercial model, as mentioned earlier, and their son, Iriolua Ajayemi launched the very first educative and entertaining game in Africa. And his full name is Iriolua Okekije Ajayemi. So Iriolua became a CEO at the age of one. This game, Ire Game, is not just for entertainment, but also for education and learning. By playing this game, you get to learn so much about Nigeria and our culture. And this game is available for download on App Store and Google Play Store. So everyone in this family is busy with one thing or the other. And they indeed share a unique and beautiful bond, just as we're seeing today. We have come to the end of this episode. We hope you enjoyed it. And let's know two new things. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.